Okay, I got a phone call from, uh, it's called DreamWorks, I think, and they wanted to rent some cannons for the Spielberg movie on Lincoln. And it was last, it was a year ago, exactly a year ago. And they came to Lancaster and looked at the cannons and the two that were standing in front of them, was a, one's a 30 pound pirate and the other one's a four and a half inch rifle. These were siege pieces that would have been used in a situation like Petersburg because it was absolute trench warfare. Uh, the soon as uh, we were involved in was uh, at City Point where the River Queen docks, and I won't tell you the trick on how they have to watch the movie, how it sails away, and then Lincoln's in the front of the boat, and then we went into Richmond. They took the capital of Richmond, which was the Confederate White House, and completely built a portico just like the real White House and they had a union encampment around it. And then uh, then they moved to Petersburg for some more scenes around the railroad station. And there's a very quaint area in uh, downtown Petersburg uh, that we filmed in. It was a unique opportunity for me to be able to supply cannons for a Spielberg movie on Lincoln. And I can't wait to be able to see the movie probably this weekend sometime. I'll go out uh, to the cinema and see it. And it just, to have something that you helped with, we did the same thing in Gettysburg, you know, to look at it back and uh, be able to say, you know, you helped a little bit, a very small way in making a film.